السلام عليكم hi guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel so guys today i'm going to be showing you how i make three different chilies at home really simple with ingredients you can find anywhere and uh, the first one is pilipili ya kukanga and uh, it's very common what you're going to need is water just a bit of water i won't use all of that then i used two carrots i grated mine then I'm using two tomatoes and I'm using one and a half onion and uh, I have two cloves of garlic. I also have some chilies, red and green chilies. Chilies are just according to your preference. If you want it to be too hot, you put many chilies. Okay. Now what I'm going to do over here, I'm blending everything together. I'm blending the onions, the tomatoes, carrots, my garlic and everything just together first so guys first of all thank you so much for your support we are in uh, day 20 of my ramadan edition where i've been posting videos every day since ramadan started and uh, i noticed a lot of new subscribers i just want to say thank you thank you and you're really welcome over here and uh, yeah don't forget to keep on sharing 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 so guys we're going to blend this, then we're going to go to the next step. Now after blending you're going to put it on a really low heat and just let it simmer for a while just like this so that it can be a bit thicker. Then the next thing that I'm going to do I'm going to add in my salt. I'm going to be using half a teaspoon of salt. Then guys I'm going I'm also going to add in half a teaspoon of sugar. It's not a must, but I noticed my chilies were really hot just by the smell. And as you can see over here, my pili pili is really like simmering. It's boiling. And I'm going to add in, um, what is this, vinegar. Yeah, one tablespoon of vinegar. You can also use lemon. You can squeeze in one lemon. It's okay. And uh, then I'm going to put in my oil. I will use two tablespoons you put your oil last minute when you're ready to just cover this and uh, yeah so guys over here my pili pili I feel like it's done you can see how it's looking it's not too runny it's a bit thick that's how you want it so guys pili pili kukanga is more mainly served with pilau it goes really really well with pilau you should actually try it and this is how mine is looking if you have a different way on how you make yours you can drop it on the comment section now the next one we are going to need carrots this is just one carrot i sliced it like that then uh, you're also going to need onions i also used one onion then next you are going to need uh, tomatoes i used one tomatoes and you're going to need one mango unripe mango guys i don't know why mine looks ripe over here i think it's because of the light and you're also going to need oil and uh, vinegar remember guys the mango has to be unripe now the first step we are just going to oil our sufuria i used like two tablespoons of oil just normal vegetable oil then i'm putting in my onions just going to cook that for a bit then next you are going to add in your tomatoes when your onions have softened up a little bit and you're going to cook this and add in your carrots now you're going to cook this until your carrots are a little bit softer I added in one teaspoon of salt then next guys i'm going to add in my green chilies i'm using two if you want it more hot you can always add in your chilies and i'm just going to mix this and add in 
one tablespoon of vinegar now when you're mixing be careful your chilies don't break inside we want them whole or at least one of them so yeah let it cook before you can add in your mango now i'm adding in my mango this is just one unripe mango guys it has to be unripe and just mix it and uh, your pili pili or chili is basically done And uh, there you have it guys this is how it's looking you see one of the chilies is whole and this one is really yummy you guys should try it now on the last one now this one is a really simple one because you just throw in everything in your blender I'm using three green chilies they're really hot guys then I have two garlic I have salt I have uh, coriander I have water one tomato and one lemon and you're going to need your blender now guys you're going to throw in everything inside your blender and you're going to blend slowly as you stop not continuously because we don't want it to blend completely so as long as your garlics blend you're good to go now over here guys you can squeeze in that one lemon you had but i squeezed it in when i was blending and it's still okay this is how it's looking a lot of people have this with some bajia or viazikarai it goes really well i just added added wah, some coriander leaves to just garnish it and this is how it's looking thank you so much for watching guys consider subscribing don't forget to like comment and share